Hi, my name is Bakhadar Ahmed. In this video lecture, we are going to discuss about determinants of the matrices and try to solve the following equation. Well, on the left hand side, I've got the determinant of the 2 by 2 matrix. On the right hand side, I've got a matrix 3 by 3 matrix. So we have to find them, equalize them, and find the, the all the values of the x which would satisfy this equation. So let's start with the left-hand side part. So in order to find the determinant of this matrix on the left-hand side, I'm just going to multiply its diagonals to each other. It's going to be x times to the 1 minus x minus, so it's minus 1 times to the 3. And this is going to be equal to the x minus x in the square plus the 3. Well, that's going to be the, the determinant of the left-hand side part. So the determinant of the right-hand side part is going to be slightly difficult. So we just need to go through one of the rows. And I see the zero here on the first row. So that is why that goes through the first row. So the idea of, of finding the determinants using the cofactors is that we are going to go through the entries of one of the rows. In this case, the first row. We are going to choose the entry, eliminate the row in the column where it is located, and multiply this element, 1 in this case, to the determinant of the matrix which is left, which is going to be x minus 6, 3x minus 5. Right? The second entry is going to be 0, multiplied to any determinant is simply going to be 0. Right? So you have to do the same thing with the 0. Then was the 3. We are going to choose the 3. We are going to eliminate the row and the column where the 3 is located. Or I think it is 3, right? Um, minus 3. So plus minus 3 multiplied 2 now to the determinant of the matrix which is left, which is 2, x, 1, and 3. Now we are just going to simplify all the terms. So the determinant of this matrix here is going to be x in the square minus 5x. So minus minus 6 multiplied to the 3. Then minus 3 multiplied to the 6 minus x. So if I open up the brackets, what we get is so minus 6. Okay. So let's open the brackets up. It's going to be x in the square minus 5x plus 18 minus 18 plus 3x. Well, if you simplify the terms out, we are going to eliminate this 18 and 18 here. This minus 5x and this 3x are going to cancel each other partially. And we are going to have x in the square minus 2x on the right-hand side part. So that's going to be the determinant of the right hand side matrix, which is 3 by 3 matrix. So now we just need to equalize those determinants and find the, the values of the x which would satisfy this equation. I'm just going to put all of the x squares in one of the sides of the equation. So this x square going to this side, to the right hand side, will give me 2x in the square. So this x going to the right hand side part is going to make this minus 3x. And the 3 going to the right is also going to be minus 3. And this is equal to the 0. Well, in order to find the roots of this equation, we are going to find the determinant or uh, discriminant, sorry, which is going to be b in a square. So I'm just going to write down the formula b in a square minus 4ac, where the coefficient before the x is going to be denoted as the b, the coefficient before the x in the square is denoted as the a, and the free coefficient is denoted as the c. So let's just put the values of the b, a, and c into this formula and calculate this. It's going to be minus 3 in the square, it's 9, minus 4 times to the 2 times to the minus 3, which is going to be 8 times to the minus 3, which is 24, right? Plus 24, plus 9, it's going to be 33. Then the first root and the second root of this equation is going to be found by using the following formula, minus b plus minus Square root of discriminant divided to the 2a. Well, in this case, it's going to be equal to the 3 plus minus square root of 33 divided to the 2a, which is 4. Well, two values of the x which would satisfy our initial equation, matrix equation, looks like this. Thank you very much for your attention. I hope that this was helpful for you.